Hello friends, hi, I hope you are doing well and in this video and a new video I am going to speak about uh, a new opportunity from Salva government. Salva government clearly gives a number of scholarships for international students for specific countries and uh, in this new year in 2023 uh, the government has announced uh, a new number of scholarships for students. And the deadline uh, is until uh, May 30, May 30, and uh, you can uh, fill the application until the end of the May of 2023. In this video, I will uh, speak about the benefits of this scholarship and the, in, uh, nearly the necessary documents, the required documents about uh, this scholarship. And in next video, uh, I will. Uh, I will guide you about how to apply for this scholarship step by step. Okay friends, so watch the video until the end and uh, I will say everything to you. Okay, friends, I will put the link of the post at the description of this video uh, and you can, as well as you can uh, search uh, uh, on your browser, type www.o for students dot com when you enter to this page uh, to this website that's our website you can uh, see uh, the Solva government scholarship for international students uh, in 2023-24 uh, academic year friends the first uh, post here is about the Solva government scholarship here are uh, other uh, scholarships and as well as other information about uh, different uh, universities and different uh, opportunities, different countries. Click on Slovakia Government Scholarship and uh, here is a little bit information about the uh, scholarship. The Minister of Education, Science, Research and Sport of Government of Slovak uh, uh, annually awards 48 scholarships to students from OTA. ODA nations or ODA countries. Uh, there is a link, uh, there is a link of the ODA countries. You can check here uh, if uh, your nationality is eligible for applying this uh, scholarship. Okay, with, uh, I don't speak about the uh, information, but you can search on Google as well as uh, why you should study at Solvok, uh, Solvok a country. And it's one of the uh, European United. Uh, Sorry, it's one of the uh, United Europe uh, members and one of the European countries. Uh, so, Tokyo government, this scholarship is uh, for bachelor, master, or doctoral. It provides entry level of degrees, uh, and as well as it's fully funded. Uh, but there are some specific countries. You can click here. The list of countries uh, will be downloaded, and you can check uh, if your country is uh, in the list. You can apply. You can apply for different uh, universities and as well as there is uh, no difference between male and female. Even if you are male or female, you can apply for the scholarship. But the language of uh, instruction is uh, Sulbog. You need to uh, study in Sulbog language. And uh, for students to, uh, who don't have the ability of speaking in Sulbog language, uh, there is a, a one-year uh, preparation classes of uh, the language. Uh, you will take one-year language classes. And it doesn't need any fees. Uh, you can apply until end of May 2022. Okay, we, uh, uh, here we will speak about scholarship benefits. Uh, for bachelor degree, the benefit of uh, this scholarship is about uh, 280 uh, euros uh, each month uh, it's uh, for costs and different things for university costs and as well as the step uh, end of beginning it's about at the beginning uh, 25 euros and 100 euros is a study completion step end after the completion of the study and uh, 80 euro for uh, in, uh, 80 euro per month uh, student at public university for public universities uh, they give uh, 80 euros for you uh, and there are uh, another like uh, uh, medical examination and uh, other things uh, other benefits 
And these are the benefits for PhD, PhD students. And if you are at the first uh, year and if you are studying uh, language, uh, these are the benefits for those who are studying the language. But according to the situation, uh, the, these costs may be, sorry, these benefits may be increased uh, according to the situation of uh, the, the country. Here is a calculation of fees in Slovakia about housing or dormitory may cost you uh, 46 to 77 euros per month and the mail may cost you 240 euro per month and medical examinations between 183 uh, and 264 euros and the other uh, things is calculated here uh, according to the uh, situation of the country and these benefits are arranged uh, according to these calculations. Which fields are available? All fields are av available, but for different countries, there are some specific fields that you can choose. Like for uh, Georgia, uh, Republic of Kenya, uh, Rep Republic of Moldova, and Federal Democratic Republic of Ethiopia, uh, these measures ca can be selected, and other measures uh, or fields are not allowed to be selected. But there are uh, medical fields, uh, pharma pharmacy, uh, dentistry, or other fields uh, for different countries, like uh, engineering, uh, mechanical engineering, nursing, uh, public health, uh, electrical and electronic engineering, chemical engineering. For different countries, there are different uh, uh, fields, like for Albania, Bosnia, uh, and Kosovo, there are uh, less uh, fields that they can choose, just they can choose these fields. And uh, you can read the other uh, countries here. For Ukraine, there is available uh, uh, the opportunity available both for Ukraine too. Uh, available phase for Ukraine, economics and management, except tourism, physics, chemistry, uh, earth science, sciences, agriculture, and landscape, forestry, and other fields. You can check. Uh, you can read the all fields uh, here by clicking here full list of fields you can click here and the list will be downloaded now we will speak about required documents which documents are required the first thing is diploma from your last degree the second uh, document is academic transcript from your last degree and the third uh, document uh, that's necessary that's Passport. You must have passport, and besides that, the fourth thing is birth certificate, and the uh, fifth one is a two letter of recommendations. You must have at least two letter of recommendations, and sixth, a signed curriculum vitae, and as well as a signed uh, motivation. You can prepare your motivation letter and your CV in one document, like uh, uh, its first page uh, must be motivation letter and you should sign at the end of that motivation letter and uh, after that you should uh, prepare your CV according to the Europass uh, and uh, sign at the end of your CV too. Okay, if you have any publications you can provide the information to the system. If you don't have, it's not uh, compulsory. Uh, the eighth thing, uh, eighth document is you, you must provide uh, one of your picture, your photograph. And the ninth one, a letter of acceptance. A letter of acceptance, it's just only for the students that they uh, have already know the language. They don't have any problem on the civil language and uh, they, will, uh, they want to start directly to the uh, university. Uh, they need an acceptance. If you don't uh, have the uh, ability of speaking uh, the civil language, it's not required to uh, have any acceptance later. The last uh, document is a uh, signed application form. It's uh, an application form while you apply online. At the end of the application, uh, at the end of that form, you must uh, download, download the form and sign it, scan it again and upload it to the system. Then submit uh, your online application.
Okay, if you want to uh, reach to the full uh, documents, to the full information of uh, required documents, click here, the list will be downloaded. But there is the age limit for bachelor's and master's degree applicants must be between 18 and 26 years. Uh, for, and for PhD, the uh, applicants must be at least 23 and uh, the upper age is 35. How to apply? For applying, you need to click apply now here and uh, you will be directed to the uh, application page. I will make a video step by step about how to apply in the next video. I will go and will come back at the end of this video. I will put the uh, link of that video at the description and as well as uh, at the end of this uh, video. Thank you friends. If you liked our video, uh, please uh, make your comment and uh, these comments will give us energy for continue our work. As well as subscribe to our channel for the notification to reach new videos. Thank you. Have a good time.